Hey guys, Wellington here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a Brother printer to print on DVDs, Blu-rays and CDs. I'll be using a Brother printer MFC-J870DW. Now the process for some models might be a little bit different, but the basics are all pretty much the same. I use new soft CD labeler software to design my DVDs and Blu-rays, um, and it comes with a printer. So let's get started. Assuming you've already installed the software on your machine, now let's go ahead and open it. Click start program and here you'll see all these cool templates that you can edit to your taste but I've always used a blank template so I'm going to select that and click apply. The edit window will appear. Click label size settings to configure the label size before you start your design process. I like to keep the outer diameter all the way to the max and the inner diameter all the way to the minimum. And that's because I like my DVD print covering the entire DVD like this, but not like this one right here. Press OK and begin designing your label. Now this software has a really really easy layout so it's not hard to figure out where stuff is so I'm not going to go into details about the designing process because I'm pretty sure you can figure it out. So when you're done with the design process and happy with the results, click print, select your machine's name from the drop down menu in the dialog box and for the paper size select 12 cm desk in brackets 4.7 inch and click OK. Wait for a second for the software to communicate with your printer. The machine will then prompt you to make sure there is at least 4 inches of space behind the machine. And that's because when you're printing, the print tray comes out the back of the printer at least 4 inches out. So make sure there is more than 4 inches behind your machine. And then click OK. So now we leave the computer and go to the printer. If the two are communicating properly, the printer should be saying this on its display. So if that's what you have, let's go ahead. Open the scanner cover and remove the disk tray. And firmly place the printable disk onto the disk tray. Push and pull down the disk guide to open it. Insert the disk tray into the disk guide and make sure to line up the triangular marks on the disk tray and the disk guide. And this is serious. Do not push the disk tray all the way into the disk guide. If you do so, it will get stuck inside. Press OK and the machine will start printing. And when it's done, I usually wait for about 30 to 60 seconds and then remove the disk from the disk tray. Thanks for watching, but I would really love to hear from you guys. And what printer and app do you use to print your CD labels? Leave your comments down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Um, like the video and I will see you in the next video.